Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a super casual and super chatty get ready with me video. So if you follow me over on Instagram, you may already know kind of what's been going on in our life the last few weeks. Basically, I'm just going to be sitting here talking to y'all like you are right here with me and telling you everything that's been going on the last two weeks and also what to expect from my channel. Now, I will not be going over in detail all of the makeup that I use because I do have a get ready with me video that kind of explains everything in more detail, but I will have all of the products that I'm using today in the description box below. So definitely check those out if you're interested but let's go ahead and get started. So if you have been watching my channel for a while and if you've seen the About Me video, I'm kind of briefly mentioned on there, my husband is an air traffic controller. Oh, this is what I'm using, it's an elf brand. <laughs> my husband is an air traffic controller in the FAA and so we were stationed down south for several years in the Air Force, but ever since being in the FAA, he has, we've been, living in Sioux Falls, South Dakota, and we really, really love it here. It's a really great place to raise our family, and we really love it, but our end goal was to kind of always just to make it back, or not make it back, but make it to Utah. It's a lot closer to Montana, where we originally from, and so that's kind of been our end goal. Um, and so we've had papers in to get transferred there for at least a year now, and it's kind of hard to get transferred depending on like where you're going, depending on like if they need a lot of people there or not. But we did finally get picked up about two weeks ago. We got the news that he was selected to be transferred. So we were really excited about that. It kind of came as a surprise because we had just not gotten picked up for so long that we were kind of almost like not expecting to get picked up at this point. But um, we did get picked up and we're super, super excited about it. All right, guys, I'm like so all over the place. The last few weeks have just been insane and I'm really tired, so I really need this concealer. <laughs> so we are so excited about that, but we found out that we, that our timeline is going to be really pretty quick. We have to be there by the middle of March. And so we have like not that long of a time that we have to get our house in South Dakota sold and also find a house in Utah. And so we started looking for houses like right away and we've kind of been looking online over the last year, just casually looking for houses to kind of see what's going to be there. And we found one actually recently when we, where is my stuff? Oh, here it is. We found one like a few days after we found out that we were going and what our timeline was and it was just perfect. We have not seen a house that we loved so much. And so we're so, so excited about it. So we actually put an offer in on it before we even had our house listed here, just because we know that the market there is pretty crazy and houses will sell within hours of being put on the market there. And so we didn't wanna lose the house. So we put an offer on it and it got accepted and we had a contingent on selling our house here. And so we knew that we needed to list our house here like right away. So basically within like two or three days, we, um, we had our house ready to be listed. We had it photographed and everything and it was just a crazy few days. And those were the days like right before Christmas. It was the like Thursday and Friday right before Christmas. So it was crazy with that on top of regular Christmas stuff. And we were also like kind of trading around sicknesses and things. So it was just a wild week, but we made it and we got it done. And then yesterday we had a showing, we had, we had several showing actually, actually we had three the first day that we listed it. And then we had 12 showings on our house the next day, which was yesterday. So we were out of the house all day long and it was crazy and it was a tiring, long, long day. But uh, we ended up getting three full price offers on our house. So we were super, super, super excited about that. And we accepted one last night. So now we have our house in Utah, which will be closing on the middle of February. And also our house here, which we will also be closing on a few days before that in February. So everything is working out good, but it is just so crazy. So we are, we definitely have a lot that we've kind of bitten off. So we have to kind of make it work, but it will be awesome and it will all pay off. 
and you can't see what this is, but it is just the e.l.f. regular eyeliner pencil in black. But anyway, yeah, so we are super excited that everything has kind of worked out so far, although it has been a crazy little while, but it's, it's going to pay off. And this is supposed to be our forever home, so we're really excited to get somewhere. And we've been moving, obviously, for several years because we were in the military. And so it will be amazing to just not have to move anymore <laughs> and just be somewhere and we can settle down and our kids won't have to be like changing schools all the time. So we are really excited for this move. It's going to be a wonderful thing for our family. So yeah, we're super excited. But the next thing, so that's kind of what has been going on the last few weeks. Now the next thing that I wanted to talk to everyone about is kind of what to expect from my channel. So I will be doing my same kind of videos. I'll still be doing like my grocery hauls, maybe the grocery hauls, and I will be doing my cleaning videos and my recipe videos and things like that. And you know, a few other videos here and there, but a lot I am planning on vlogging and filming some more of like, like some tips for packing and just like some pack with me type videos, <laughs> like packing up our house and tips I've found over the years of packing and moving and things like that and sharing those things with you. So if there are any of those kind of videos that y'all would like to like request to see, let me know if there's anything like in particular that you want to see because I can definitely make it happen. I will have an entire house to pack up <laughs> so I can film a lot of that. So I'm sure there will be lots and lots of lots of things that I can film and share with you guys. But yeah, let me know if there are anything like that that you would like to that you would like to see because I can definitely make that happen. I'm sorry, I'm just getting carried away talking and I'm not even showing you guys what this is, but I will have this link down below. I put this mascara underneath my actual favorite mascara just to kind of bulk it up a little bit, but I really, really love the e.l.f. brand. It It's so inexpensive and it works really well. I really, really like it just, I think because it's so inexpensive, but it doesn't seem like cheap makeup. So it's definitely one of my favorite things. And they usually carry it at Target is where I usually pick it up, but they do have some on Amazon and places like that as well. So, but anyway, uh, you gotta stay so focused when you're doing this. And I kind of have like a mirror set up behind my phone because I record with my phone. And <laughs> so I probably look kind of crazy in the mirror, but I'll make it happen. Now these I am going to mention are my very favorite mascara. It's the Unique Moodstruck Transplanting Gel and Fiber Lashes. So it's like the 3D lashes and it makes such a difference in my eyelashes. It's like my favorite makeup ever. And you can get it on Amazon, so I will link that in the description box as well because this stuff is awesome. And what you do with it is you just put like this transplanting gel on underneath, like on the like first bottom layer, whatever you would say, <laughs> or you'd say that. And then on the bottom, I do just, just that stuff. And so then on the top, you do the same thing you put this on just like mascara, it's just black. And then you put on these fibers and I don't know if you can see, Let's see if that will like, but they're just like little tiny fibers and they will actually stick to the transplanting gel. And it makes your lashes so thick and long. It just, it's crazy. And this stuff lasts like all day long and even until almost the next day if you don't take it off. Like yesterday, it was so crazy. We had showing after showing starting from 8 a.m. We had 30 minutes to get ready for it because they called us at 7.30 asking if they could show this house. And we were like, well, yeah. <laughs> so we had to get everybody dressed and ready for the day. I was about to get into the shower when we got the call and they asked if they could show it to us and I was like, yeah, okay. So I didn't take a shower yesterday. I just like rinsed off real quick, but I didn't do my hair or my face even because I knew I didn't have time to do my makeup. 
So I walked around yesterday without, like, with just yesterday's hair and makeup, and it was pretty crazy, but it was such a long day. And then our last showing was at 7.30 at night, and yeah, it was the longest day, you guys. Especially, like, we had our two dogs, thank goodness, for our good friends who let us kind of keep our dogs at their house for most of the day, but... Yeah, we had our two dogs with us for part of the day, and then we have, of course, our three little boys, and it's freezing out, so we couldn't just go, like, hang out and play at a park, because we live in South Dakota, and it was, like, freezing, freezing, <laughs> so we just had to kind of hang out and go. We went to, like, a movie, and we hung out at a friend's house for a little bit. I don't know what we did. It was just... I just can't tell you how excited I was to sit in our bed last night and just lay down and go over the offer that we got. So it couldn't have worked out any better. It was definitely a long day, but it couldn't have worked out any better. And we're super, super, super thankful that it did work out how it is. But um, yeah, so anyway, let me know if there are any of those videos that you would like to see, like if you really want like a kitchen, like a kitchen packing video, or I will also be doing decluttering while I'm packing because that's one thing that we really take advantage of whenever we move is I try and declutter everything and just get rid of whatever we can because I don't know, I feel like, I don't know how it happens, but you just accumulate so much stuff whenever you're, especially when you have kids, I think, but even not, like you just, I don't know, I don't feel like we get that much stuff all the time, but somehow we always have stuff. Like we always have toys. We always have extra kitchen utensils and things like that. And I just want to kind of clear out and start a little more fresh. And so if you want to see like those decluttering videos or just packing videos or just tips, like a more structured video or a lot of more vlogs, whatever you want to see, just let me know in the comments below. And I will try and make those happen because as I said, there will be a lot of things that I can film. We have a lot to get done in a very short amount of time. So I hope that I can get a lot filmed for you guys because I would love to do that. And it'd be kind of fun to document that as well. I know this was super, super casual and not quite as structured as most of my videos are, but I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. And you now you guys kind of know what's been going on with my life, why I haven't been posting my videos quite as frequently as I normally have been. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to subscribe down below if you're not already and also follow me over on Instagram because I'm definitely sharing a lot of things on there that I'm not making actual videos for. I'm sharing a lot of things about our moving experience and things like that. So definitely be sure to follow me over there if you're not already. And I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.